Hello guys, Smoothie here, back with another GT Sprint race on iRacing. This time we're on Watkins Glen, one of my favorite tracks to race on. This was my first proper race in a few weeks and I was only able to get in about 5 laps of practice before the race started. So I decided to start from the back as I do so often and take it easy for the first 2 or 3 laps. For one, I want to avoid all the lap 1 carnage and two, I don't want to be the one causing the lap 1 carnage, being out of racing routine. Starting from the back proved to be the right decision as I already avoid spinning cars through turn 1. You can see me getting a 4x here, so let's check out the replay to see what really happened. The Mercedes and Ferrari next to me don't give each other enough space and as a result crash and spin out. They nearly took me out as well. Close call. Moving along, as we are coming you out of the hard. S's, we see more smoke ahead, so we slow down. A massive around. crash with multiple cars involved. A regular well, occurrence on Watkins Glen. Again, we check out the replay to see what caused the pileup and, again, a Mercedes and a Ferrari are involved. Those two just don't seem to like each other. Foreshadowing the upcoming F1 season perhaps? Most of us try to avoid the crash, but as always, someone tries to play the hero and send it. But he just ends up t-boning another poor chap, ending both their races. We skip to the end of lap 2. We are already P14 at this point, starting from P27 all positions gained from crashes. We get a really close call with Christian here. I don't know why he was going so slow, but I had to let go of the gas a lot to avoid him. As a result, I was really slow on the straight and Dominic took the opportunity to overtake me. I let him go through T1 as I didn't want to lose any time to the guys in front. Another skip right into lap 8. All this time, we were just following Dominic around. As we approach the inner loop, he tries to go for an attack on the Ferrari, which nearly ended in a crash. We both had to back out of it and lost a lot of time as a result. Dominic didn't seem like the safest driver anyways, as we'll see in the next clip. He had to slow down due to the car in front of him pitting, which gave me the opportunity to pass him on the finish straight. I wanted to go for a move here, as over the past 8 laps I felt like I could go faster than him. Side by side through turn 1, up the SS and then we crash! As you can hear, he called me an idiot and later doubled down via text chat. I didn't quite understand his reaction, as I felt like I did nothing wrong but I'll let you be the judge. Who do you think is at fault here? Moving on, we skip two laps to the first unforced error of my race. I got into a tiny slide right as I was about to turn the other way, which unsettled my car and I had to catch it before turning into the corner even more. This caused me to slow down significantly and Brian behind me got an easy pass. I followed him around for a few laps, but he was a bit faster at that point as I kinda lost my confidence in the car and clocked slower laps. I got my pit stop done, put my head down and tried to catch up to him as well as Christian from earlier again. The latter one letting me by on the straight, as I was significantly faster than him at that point. Thank you very much. Two laps later, I had already cut Brian's lead down from 2.6 seconds to about a second, and we still had three laps to go. The hunt was on. But then, I made the stupidest mistake you can make on Watkins Glen. I hit the wall on corner exit, knocking my wheels out of alignment. The car was still okay to drive, 
but it was very unstable, especially on high speeds. I decided to back out and bring the car home. And thus, we ended up finishing in P8, having started from P27. I am very happy with that result, especially as it was my first proper race back. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Every little bit helps my channel grow. I hope you have a very nice day and see you in my next video.